Hi, I'm Peter Carlobos and I will be showing you how to perform a speculum exam and taking specimen for the Papa Nicolau smear. The speculum exam is done to inspect the vaginal walls and the cervix. The pap smear, on the other hand, is used to screen women for cervical cancer. According to ACOG, initial screening should begin at ages 21 regardless of sex activity. For women ages 21 to 29, screening should occur every three years. For ages 30 to 65, they can have co-testing with pap smear plus high-risk HPV testing done every five years or pap smear alone done every three years. It is no longer recommended in women ages 65 and above if they had three consecutive negative pap tests or two consecutive negative HPV tests. Exceptions are those who are HIV positive, immunosuppressed, and exposed to diethylstilbestrol in utero. The materials you need are the following, speculum of appropriate size for the patient, sterile gloves, cotton swab, cytobrush or cotton tip applicator, aries spatula, glass slide, and lubricating jelly. Introduce yourself and explain the procedure to the patient. Address and relieve any anxieties and fears the patient have. Then place the patient on a dorsal lithotomy position. Put on gloves and observe a septic technique throughout the procedure. Warm the vaginal speculum either by a warming device or warm water. Using a water-based lubricant can facilitate a more comfortable exam for the patient. Place two fingers in the introitus and press down. Insert the speculum by placing the transverse diameter of the blades in the anterior posterior position and guiding the blades through the introitus in a downward motion with the tips pointing toward the rectum. Insert the blades to their full length, then turn the speculum so that the transverse axis of the blades is in the transverse axis of the vagina. Open the speculum and visualize the cervix. Next, inspect the vaginal walls, known for erythema, lesions, and fluid discharges. Afterwards, Inspect the cervix. Take note of erosions, shape, the transformation zone, and any lesions. For specimen collection of the pap smear, gently remove excess mucus with the use of a cotton swab or applicator. Sample the endocervical canal with a cytobrush or cotton tip applicator, which is placed into the canal and is rotated. The sample is smeared thinly on a glass slide by rotation of the brush. This is labeled endocervix and fixed immediately. With an aorist spatula, the entire transformation zone is scraped. The sample is smeared thinly on the second slide, which is immediately fixed and labeled transformation zone. Lastly, remove the speculum by twisting the adjustment screw and closing the speculum. Turn the speculum sideways and remove it gently. 